Dan is on. Dan has a fish. What kind of fish? Only Dan knows. We're gonna hop right to it in this episode because we are on a little bit of a time crunch. We got Captain Dan at the helm. Yo. And Dan just picked me up from my house, which is right over there behind those bushes. It's 2 p.m. already, so we only have a few hours to fish. Can we catch a fish in just a few hours? That's the question. That's the yeah, freaking pressure question. Pressure is on. Pressure is on, and we're here in Key Largo. We're gonna head out and just get on to it. All right, we're out here on some patch reefs in 10 feet of water, about a mile from land. Gonna put some chum out. Some nasty chum. Let's see if we can find some cigar minnows. Oh, it's really shallow here. Oh, it's 10 feet? Okay. Okay, we could not find the bait. I repeat, we could not find the bait. So we're pulling the anchor. We barely got any time to fish. Luckily, Dan, he did catch maybe like 15 pilchards earlier today. So we got 15 live baits. Let's see what we can turn that into. Now we're gonna run off the reef's edge and we're gonna drift them on the bottom, right off the reef's edge in like a hundred feet of water. Dan just dropped one of our yeah, they tell the whole world. baits off the side of the boat. <laughs> he fell off the hook. He fell off the hook. All right. We only have so many baits. It ain't that many. Mine's on a circle hook through the nose. Come on. What's he getting caught on? What? Is this stupid. That's what happens when I don't have my clippers. Ah. What is going on? Okay, I'm leaving this clip open on the way, so it should come off pretty easy. Pretty easy. Okay, on the bottom. Now we wait for a bite. All right, so what do we got? We got one, you got one pilchard on the bottom. Yep, one pilchard on the bottom. One pilchard on the top. One on the bottom, one on the top. I, that top one might get one of them tunas. That would be nice. That's what we're looking for. Nice big tuna. Such a slow drift today. Oh! Hands on! I was on. I was on. Oh, I was on, no! Let's see if I still have my bait. I think it stole my bait. No, I still have my bait. No way. He's still alive, too. Look at that. Nice. Get back out there. Do your job. Yeah. There are no taking breaks on this job. One job in life, get out there and do it. Oh no, oh no, I got a knot. I quit. It's gonna be that kind of fishing. Day. I should have took a different career path. All right, there we go. I'm still trying to get this jig squared away. Oh, I almost just dropped my Woo! weight off the boat. What's going on today? There's some kind of bad karma going on. I should be getting good karma. All right, there we go. Yes, you should be. I thought I just had a bite. It's getting a little bumpy down there. Yeah, I mean, like this whole area is technically. Good, yeah. Oh, something just bit me off. Bit you off? Yep. Okay. Kingfish down there. So then what's going on with my guy? Tink me right off. Uh, do I not have a bait on? Hmm, maybe I should put some wire on. This time I got him on the stinger tip. A little bit of wire. You ain't gonna get away from me this time. Fish. Hey, I got another knot. Oh, there we go. We got them long leaders today. I just felt something. Oh, mama drama. Baby mama drama. Picking one up off the bottom. Could be a shark. Yeah, I think it got shark. But. You know, I mean, we're able to turn it, so he might be all right. Might be a keeper something. He's on too. Is it? They're on, yeah. Double hook up. You're gonna need a gaff. You were gonna need a gaff, all right, but he ain't nowhere near up here yet. Oh, we're gonna get it. So go get the gaff. 
All right, the pilchard, the live pilchard on the bottom, on the wire, got eight. So this could be anything. Anything. It could be a shark. It could be anything. Could be a mutton. Could be an AP. Could be an AP. I'm, I'm guessing AP. You know, I don't think it's a shark. If I had to put money on it, I would say not a shark. This could be an AP, honestly. This could be an AP. Okay, we're on leader. Uh, the weight's gone, so the weight fell, fell off. Oh, he's down there. It's a greenish color. Is that a grouper? That yeah, might be a mutton. That's a mutton, I think. Nope. Oh, big mutton. That's a big mutton. Big mutton. All right, let's, uh, let's get him. That's a big one. That's a big <laughs> oh, baby. <laughs> sweet. Yeah. That is so on, on, on wire. <laughs> That's crazy. All right, cool. Wow, oh, big boy face. Martin oh, on the wire. A beast, that's a beast, beast. Yeah, he's a big juicy a big boy. boy. And that's how we do it right there. All right, well, there it is. That's how it's done. Nice job. Wow. Oh, where are we putting him? He won't fit in there. Okay, hold back. Let me think. Uh, I could put him up front, but we'd have to transfer some ice. Hmm. You don't have your kill bag with you? No, that is a beauty. Single hook, right? Yeah. No, wait a minute. Where's the? Oh, that's yeah, it. Yeah, it's just a little single, single J hook. All right. Damn, that is a big that's mutton. A big one, oh yeah. <laughs> Woo -wee. That right there is a mutton. Woo -wee. Looks like we're all pulling up muttons off the reef today, baby. Muttons and APs. Muttons and APs. Yeah, Casey over there that I just filmed catch that one, he just pulled up an AP too. So if you want to catch fish, go book a charter with Casey. He's got them. Yo, hold them up. Big shout out to Casey once again. He just came by, gave us a bunch of live pilchards because we ran out. So now we got enough bait to do a couple more drifts and maybe we'll catch another fish. Dan is on. on. Oh yeah. Okay, so, and you're gonna have to hand line it, right? I'm gonna have to hand line this Dan. Dan's gonna have to hand line it. I don't want to. Oh, there's the weight. Uh-oh. There's the weight already? Okay, time to hand line it. What is that? Ah, who knows, slippery dick probably. No. What is that? Oh, it's a grouper. It's a baby grouper. Put the gaff away. <laughs> <laughs> you sure you don't want me to gaff that thing? <laughs> hey, at least it's not a rock. <laughs> Good looking little grouper you got there. He bent that rod over. Damn, dude. Someday you're going to be a big boy. Yeah, he'll be a big boy one day. Oh, Dan's on. Oh my gosh, Dan, your rod just bent over. You still on? Yeah. Okay, good. Dan is hooked up, and that looks good. That looks good. It's an epic battle. Epic. Oh yeah, I lost my pilchard. Whatever took it, took it. Dan is on. Dan has a fish. What kind of fish? Only Dan knows. <laughs> Dan, Dan don't know. Dan don't know? Danny boy don't know. Dan don't know Dan. Dan Yeah, where's your uh, gaff? Oh, back down here. Oh, you're hand lining? I do not like this part. Is that silver enough? That baby mutton maybe? It's like a baby mutton. What the hell? Oh, it's an Almaco Jack. Almaco Jack. You gonna keep that or not? Nah? Uh, no, I'm not. Back you will go, my friend. Almaco Jack. Yeah, you want a knife? Yep. Let's just do it right over the water. You got a lot of line just laying around. You told me I needed a lot of line. 
so I took his word for it. There he goes. Oh! <laughs> there you go. Wait, is he on? What the fuck is that on? He's not on? Oh, you just got slammed. Oh man, Casey had some nice pilchards. Do you think you still have your hook on there? I think I still have the hook. Well, no, I don't know. Who knows? I, don't, right. I guarantee I don't have the pilchards. I'm putting this stinger rig out. Whoa, he's trying to shake the hook. <laughs> you right? Yeah, fish on! Nice! This is one fishy day. Yeah. Very nice. Oh. Oh. He's got some bolitos. He's got a weird head shake. I don't know what that is. Like it almost feels like a tuna head shake, but would, but nice. but I got him off the bottom. There's no way that's a tuna. Are we gonna need gas for this? My, yeah, probably. All right, sinker is off. What in the world do we have here? Oh, it's an Almaco Jack. I knew he was, he felt funny. He's going back? Hmm. He does have some meat on him. They are delicious fish. Are they, is that a keeper? I don't know. Ah, yeah, we'll send them back. You got them pliers on you? Uh, yeah. Whoa. Oh. oh, almost broke the rod. Nice. And looks like we kept it. Cool. Oh, oh. Yes. Come on. Ah. Didn't get hooked. I probably lost my bait right there. Well, it's not a fishing trip without a tangle. So let's see how bad it is. That's the, yeah, that's the, that's the, how bad is it? How bad is it? Is that's your it? fish. Oh my, oh my God, figure the odds. Wow, our hooks caught how each other. That? Look at that, that's impossible. Look at that, impossible to happen. And yet, stranger than truth. Oh, so that's my fish. Yeah, your fish. Uh, and I'm slightly tangled around you, but no big deal. Look at that. Perfect. Wow. Perfect. Ow. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Anything for the viewers. <laughs> Dan almost got a hook in his finger. He did get a hook in his finger. Meow. I just see him go. Holy smokes. 